working fireplaces. Oh my God, it's huge. Yes, I don't know if you can live and help. No, 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 it's just the two of us. Huh. That's strange. What? Is this room smaller than it should be? You're the first person to notice. No one from our office had the slightest idea. It's called a panic room. What? It's a safe room. Castle keep in medieval times. Fort concrete walls, very strong line not connected to the house's main line. The have your own ventilation system, and the back of surveillance monitors that covers nearly every corner of the house. So what's to keep someone from prying open the door? Steel. Very thick steel. My room. Definitely my room. Your parents chose them after a great deal of consideration. We're here to spoil you rotten. But in this perfect house... At least I'm not hopelessly greedy at borrowing a million dollars from some loan shark. Which I would have paid off by now. There are secrets she can't uncover. The Guardians for Red and me, they're not what they seem at all. I overheard your conversation. You were listening in on my call? Suspicions she can't ignore. I'm never alone here. I watch everything I do. And behind the perfect couple, I found a big new personal piggy bank. When we spoke after the funeral, you said that we had more than enough. How much would that be? Four million dollars. Lies their perfect crime. She'll get into your medical bag. Took your breath, 16 year old. Suicide just makes more sense. You and I are gonna have some straight talk right now. Where are the children? This is where I should have put you from day one. You've got to sleep sometime. Even guardians let down their guard. Ruby, 